Fatima College, Madurai, conducted the National Youth Parliament in association with Xavier Board of Higher Education in India on 26th and 27th April 2022. The National Youth Parliament was conducted in three different phases. In phase 1, the invitation for the program was sent to various colleges and 16 colleges registered themselves. Out of the 16 colleges, 10 colleges were selected for the semi-finals on 26 April 2022. In phase 2, the semi-finals began with the inauguration. After the inaugural session, the colleges selected for the semi-finals conducted model parliamentary sessions and were judged by the panel of judges. As a part of Phase 2, meet and greet session with Dr. P.T.R. Palaniwel Tyagharajan, Honorable Minister of Finance and Human Resource Management, was conducted on 26 April 2022 at 7 p.m. During the meet and greet session, the participants and the students interacted with Dr. P.T.R. Palaniwel Tyagharajan, Honorable Minister of Finance and Human Resource Management. Out of the nine colleges that participated in the semi-finals, five colleges were selected for the finals. In phase three, the finals was conducted on 27th April 2022. In the final round, the finalists performed the model parliamentary sessions. 4,500 children per day died. The valedictory session began at 12.15 p.m. The participants from various colleges expressed their gratitude for the hospitality offered by Fatima College and look forward to participate in such meaningful programs. From your college, so thank you for that. So we realized that how Fatima's hospitality would be. And we gained a lot of things here. We learned a lot of things. The results were announced. St. Anthony's College, Shillong, won the first prize of Rs. 20,000. St. Pius Degree College, Hyderabad, won the second prize of Rs. 15,000. St. Joseph's College, Trichy, came third and won Rs. 10,000. Individual prize winners were given cash prizes of rupees 2000 each the individual prizes include the prizes for the best speaker the best prime minister the best opposition leader and the best minister the overall program was an insightful event providing opportunities for the young students to know about politics and voice out their opinions on socially relevant issues.